What, what is it about failure that have, that have you learned so far? In, uh, you know, you've gone around the world many times as mm. collecting these mm. examples of, of innovation failures. So, you know, in so many countries already. What is the one thing about failures that have you learned that you can share with us? I started off with the museum's aim being that we need to accept failure if we want progress. Right. Um, and the, the past year and a half has just really, really uh, emphasized that, that, mm. that point. Right. That um, uh, it doesn't matter where I go in the world or which industry uh, I'm involved in, um, uh, everyone needs to improve their ability to accept failure and to learn from it. And, and move on. And move on and, and learn from it and then, and, and then uh, turn that, lear that uh, insight into success. And be the wiser for it. Yeah. And on a personal level, um, I still fail all the time. <laughs> it's a bit easy though um, uh -huh. uh, when you're uh, the director and curator of the Museum of Failure, people forgive you for screwing oh, up. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right. Dr. Samuel West, it's been fun talking to you. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you. I was talking to Dr. Samuel West, who is the world's first and perhaps the only curator of the Museum of Failures. It's interesting, according to Dr. West, failure is a very necessary part of innovation. There is no shame in talking about one's failures because learning from failures is the most powerful learning of all. And, and not having um, the energy or the clarity of purpose to overcome one's failures can really get one down. So the, to the question, how does one person overcome his failures or her failures? Um, I think the answer to that question would be to have a great clarity of your values and your purpose and have a good dose of leadership energy within you. That's the only way that can make a person to successfully overcome the failures in their life and turn failures into innovation for success in the creation of a better future. I hope to see you guys again. Thank you for listening. Signing off from Leadership Energy Summit Asia 2018. This is Mohamed Sabri from ICLIF. Goodbye.